There are some road projects in Chatham County that have everything to do with VinFast moving to North Carolina, but the problem for some people, more than two dozen homes and some businesses will be impacted. That's where we go to WRAL's Monica Casey on this. Monica, you're in Chatham County. Explain what roads will impact neighbors there. Well, NCDOT is looking at changes to US-1 and old US-1, but the state would need to acquire some private property for these projects. Based on the current design, Mary Oaks Baptist Church would have to be relocated, but NCDOT emphasizes that is still subject to change. Now, under the current plans, phase one would impact three businesses and 11 homes, and phase two would be estimated to impact two more businesses and another 16 homes. I spoke with a resident on New Elm Church Road. Her home will not be directly impacted by the road construction, but she does anticipate her area will be busier. She's concerned about her neighbor's homes. While we understand that there needs to be change, and we welcome the change, and we understand that there needs to be growth in the, the revenue potential that it's going to bring to the state for the jobs and everything it's create, going to create, we welcome all of that. But to, to blindside the families that are going to be affected by this one week before the public meeting, that's just not right. Lorraine McAvoy tells me she wants to understand more about the planning process for this, and she wants NCDOT to look at alternate solutions. Now, the current schedule has right-of-way acquisition for Phase 1 beginning next month. NCDOT does also have a public meeting about this today at 4, and we will be there. Chris? All right. Thanks, Monica.